So we're looking here to the Bitcoin price was the last status. Um, today is the Fed meeting and uh, we expect high volatility. That, that means the price can go here up or down. And uh, to predict the market before the Fed meeting is relative difficult. Yeah. So because now we can make or the, the Fed make here a lot of manipulation. Yeah. Why? I explain you this. We have here a left shoulder head and the right shoulder formation inverse. That means the Fed can manipulate the price directly to the downside to these levels. Yeah. So it is legitimate. Yeah, you can see we have here long term uptrend and we can say okay 22,000, 6,000 to the downside. Okay, makes sense. Yeah. So this is the first possibility. Second possibility we can uh, argument okay, we have here a channel. Yeah, and you can see we test this channel so much so that we can stay here and that we not drop so that we can fly. Yeah. If you're asking me, maybe I'm wrong, but I think um, I know they can manipulate the price to lower levels, yeah. To uh, especially um, to 24,000, 26,000. But uh, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Yeah. I think the price will fly to higher levels. I see here a W pattern. Yeah, in which I think uh, the price will fly, especially if you look to this area, then you can see we have uh, here a situation in which we test the green line, green line so much here. Yeah, and this is highly positive. So once the price is going to this level here, thirty thousand, then we will break this structure here. And that means if we can break the structure, higher levels wait for us. So I think in this case, um, the price can go up. This is my view. We will go here to the upside, but I'm also honest to you. Uh, this is a place in which the Fed can manipulate the market very good, especially if you look here to the left side you can see a lot of negativity in which uh, the price can go easily the price can go easily to these levels here 24,000 yeah because we have now the spectrum this spectrum goes from 24,000 yeah if we can if we break this then 22,000 to spectrum to 33,000. Yeah, and this is uh, the possibility in which the market can uh, manipulate very good. Yeah. So, if you're asking me again, I'm here yeah, crypto bull. I expect here a W pattern, especially if you look here the formation, um, also the, the, the big formation here. So, everything is here positive, but you know, the Fed is. Or try to push the Bitcoin price to the downside every time, every time after the Fed meeting, the price is going down. So let's see what happens this time. I'm also prepared for the really big sell off to the downside. Yeah, especially if you look at the inverse left shoulder hat and right shoulder formation, the price could easily go here to 24,000, 26,000 levels. Yeah. Because we have here the formation to, to 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 go or dump very hard, but I think um, if you zoom in, we have here positive signs. Yeah, let's hope that the price is going up. Uh, there's a place to the to the downside. They can easily manipulate the price to the downside. Yeah, if you ask me, then I would say 60% upside, 40% downside why downside because this is pure manipulation if they manipulate the price to the downside because the signs show us the price will fly 
Yeah. So if you see that the, after the Fed announcing that the price is going here to the downside, then you know okay exactly this is the manipulation. They, these are buy areas. Yeah. So even if the price is going downside, uh, don't get your panic. These are buy areas. I think we will go directly to the upside. The price will fly. Yeah, this is my view. But um, if I look here, the, the last times here, in which um, we saw here a lot of manipulation. Yeah, let's look. Also here, the price is uh, good. Yeah, we are not in an overbought situation. So uh, to sell here to the downside, I don't think so. Yeah. So, but uh, you know, the 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 where Fed manipulate the price, they can make easily so. Yeah, that the price is going to 26, 27 areas. So is this, there's a place to go a little bit to the downside, but. If the price is going down, then you know, okay, this is the last manipulation. Because after this uh, last manipulation, we have not the possibility to go here to the downside. So think about this. They can manipulate easily the price to levels of 22,000 levels. This is the first target. Yeah. Direct. Yeah. Why? You can see the uptrend is going from here. Um, if this not happened, then uh, short-term manipulation or short manipulation to 25,000. This is what possible is, I would say, this is 20% possible, this is 40-50% possible, yeah. And what I see here is, maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, but it makes, no, for me, in my eyes, no sense that the price is going to the downside. If this is happening, then this is a pure manipulation, yeah. So from the technical point of view, if you're asking me, then you see we have here a W pattern. We have to go to this level. If you see the violet area. So and if this is happening, this is a place in which we have to break out. Yeah, that means the condition is fulfilled. You can see so many tests. So then we are landing here. Yeah, so in my eyes and if we landing here then uh, another um, formation is coming through and then again pumping yeah so let's look maybe i'm wrong i don't know yeah but uh, from a technical point of view we have to landing here but if they manipulate then landing here yeah so let's look the manipulation we have not in our hand uh from the technical point of view this and if they manipulate then this have a nice day